What up and welcome to Rama Screen YouTube channel and here's my review of Netflix new animated series Mech Cadets. Let's rock this. All right, you know me. I'm always ready to watch the latest animated show because unlike some folks who have to act like grown-ups all the time, I don't have any problems with cartoons. Thank you, Spider-Ham. So let me tell you, Mech Cadets is terrific. It's action-packed. It's heroic, it's engaging, the anime style is pristine and vibrant and stunning. Look, the simplest way to describe this show is it's kind of like the perfect cross between Thunderbirds and Pacific Rim. The difference is you don't need two people to pilot the Jaegers in Mech Cadets. And the origin of the Jaegers themselves, aka the Robos, is a mystery which I'm sure will be part of the story in the subsequent seasons and I for one cannot wait for that further excitement. From Polygon Pictures and Boom Studios, Mech Cadets series is about underdog teens joining a group of young cadets, the next generation of pilots, who've been chosen to bond with Robomechs from space and defend Earth against alien invaders that are attacking our planet. Uh, not sure if this show will receive a lot of eyeballs, seeing that there's only very little marketing strategy built around it. So I'm predicting that Mech Cadets will probably end up becoming one of those hidden gems that slowly but surely gains its popularity only by word of mouth. So there are a total of 10 episodes, each runs about 25 minutes short, and basically the robos come to Earth and choose which pilot they want to essentially bond with. Now that in itself creates its own drama because the general in charge of the whole operation has a strong-headed daughter who feels entitled to a robo, even though she may not be worthy of a robo. Meanwhile, a janitor's kid, who everyone says should be an engineer, wants to be a pilot instead and finds himself bonding with a robo he names Buddy. The enemy here is an alien species called sharks. They've got claws and armors and they can fly and they burrow themselves into the ground and they are scary and intimidating and they are many. They're legions. And they kind of remind me of those nasty-looking giant bugs in Starship Troopers, remember that? At the heart of it, Mech Cadets is a story about misfits. There's a disabled pilot who doesn't have a leg. There's a pilot who's old and aging. And even when they're in their robo format, one of them, Olivia, stands out because she's the only one who's piloting an actual man-made machine. In addition to that, there's this consistent emphasis on whether to put all humanity first or to put your loved ones first. And the choice you make between those two can define you as a person and as a pilot. I think that that is an arguable dilemma that will sort of divide audiences. But one thing is for sure, Mech Cadet's themes are loud and clear and resilient. Some of the voice cast includes notable names like Ming-Na Wen and Daniel Day Kim, both of whom did a fantastic job of accompanying their much younger co-stars. I'm also a big fan of the music score that has a very booming, courageous tune to it. And the final episode leaves you with a cliffhanger that I guarantee will make you beg for season two. Because it's obvious that the adventure is just beginning and the best is still yet to come. So yeah, overall I give Mech Cadets the rating of 4 out of 5. This is a show for kids and the kid in us. The concept may be all too familiar, but the story and the execution are sensational. So that's it. That's my review of Mech Cadets. Smash that like button. Share this video with everyone you know. Share your thoughts in the comment section below. And as always, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Let's rock this.